خدا The eyes to the right 329 The nose to the left 299 The eyes to the right 329 The nose to the left 299 So the eyes have it the eyes have it unlock Order. The eyes to the right, 308. The nose to the left, 322. <laughs> the eyes to the right, 308. The nose to the left, 322. So the nose have it, the nose have it. Unlock. I will speak to EU member states about their intentions until they have reached a decision. Until we, uh, they've reached a decision, I must say, we will pause this legislation. And let me, let me be clear, let me be clear. Our policy remains that we should not delay, that we should leave the EU on October the 31st. And that is, that is what I will say to the EU, and I will report back to the House. And one way or another, we will leave the EU with this deal to which this House has just given its assent. Yeah. I just wondered if you could clarify for us how getting Brexit done sits with pausing Brexit. Because this feels like a very, a very churlish reaction to what is a straightforward request. I must say I find the response of the Prime Minister quite extraordinary. The facts of the matter are this is yet another humiliating defeat for the Prime Minister this evening who has sought to railroad through this House legislation that requires proper scrutiny. And rightly, this House has spoken with a very clear voice to tell the Prime Minister he is not on. And furthermore, it is absolutely crystal clear what should now happen, because there is legislation passed by this House. It is the law of the land. On the basis of not agreeing a deal, that the Prime Minister is instructed, instructed Prime Minister, to seek an extension. Go to Brussels, go to Brussels and do as you have been instructed. On Saturday, this House emphatically rejected the Prime Minister's deal. Tonight, the House has... Well, you're too hasty, I've not finished yet. Tonight, the House has refused to be bounced into debating a hugely significant piece of legislation in just two days, with barely any notice and an analysis of the economic impact of this bill. The Prime Minister is the author of his own misfortune. So I make this offer to him tonight. Work with us, work with us, all of us, to agree a reasonable timetable and I suspect this House will vote to debate, scrutinise and, I hope, amend the detail of this bill. That would be the sensible way forward, and that's the offer I make on behalf of the Opposition tonight.